Uh, there's some denial still. There's some anger. There's a lot of sadness. Everybody's trying to find a way to process it. Todd Cooper is talking about his family's anguish following the murder of his second-born child, Brianna Cooper. The 24-year-old was working alone at the Croft House Furniture Store on Thursday when police say this man walked in. She sent a text to a friend letting her know that there was someone inside the location that was giving her a bad vibe. Uh, regrettably, that person did not see the text immediately. About 15 minutes later, a customer found Cooper stabbed to death. I can't imagine the pain. LAPD Chief okay. Michael Moore, who's a father, family. is asking the public to be on the lookout for the suspect, who's about six feet to six five, with short braids, wearing a painter-style mask, not an N95 as previously reported, and he had a distinctive backpack. These are very distinctive attributes. Councilman Paul Coretz says between city funds and private donations, more than $200,000 have been raised in reward money in less than a week. This is the largest I've ever seen. Chief Moore says his department has stepped up patrols along Melrose and La Brea since the end of summer as a memorial for Kupfer grows outside the store where she once worked. A radiant human being who cared deeply about not just herself and her family and friends, but also everything around her. Her father is hoping for a break in the case, not just for his family. I don't see us healing anytime soon. I would love to tell you that there's going to be a point where we're going to be better, but I feel like it's just going to be a big missing piece. And it needs to just, it can't happen to other people. It's just too hard.